Intemp Connect getting started. To take advantage of the Intemp Connect features, we need to create a user account. It's easy enough to do by going to IntempConnect.com and clicking on Create User. We have a username and a password configured, so we're going to log in with those credentials and it will take us to the next page. The first time you log in to a new account and you have no, no new loggers or no loggers synchronized, you need to work with them in the Intemp app first. So if you look at the bottom of the screen here, you'll see it says you haven't synchronized any Intemp Connect devices yet. It says to begin using Intemp Connect, you must first synchronize a device using the Intemp app on your smartphone or tablet. So here we have our tablet and we're going to log into the Intemp app and we want to make sure that we have a checkbox or check mark in the box that says I am an Intemp Connect user. And we'll put in our user name, which is our email address, and our password, which needs to match the same account information in your Intemp Connect account. And just as a refresher on how the system works together, here we have our tablet, our CX400 device, when you put batteries in the CX400 device, it begins what we call advertising that it's available for wireless communication. If we're within 100 feet or 30 meters with our tablet, we are able to communicate with it and configure it. And then once we do that, since we're logged in as an Intemp Connect user, that information is sent off to the Intemp Connect website up in the cloud. Again, you need Wi-Fi or cellular communications with your tablet or smartphone in order for that to work. Once we're logged in, we're taken to the what's called the loggers screen in the Intemp app on our smartphone or tablet, and it will display a list of all data loggers that are currently within range of the wireless Bluetooth low energy signal. I've created a, uh, a, a name for my data logger called Intemp Connect, and here it is. So I'm going to tap on that to, con to send a configuration to the data logger. So here I am connected to Intemp Connect, and I want to tap on the word configure and load a configuration into this device. This is a CX400 series, so there are four different configurations available. I'm going to select the configuration ambient storage. You can scroll through these by swiping your finger from the right side of the screen to the left to see the, all the different configurations available. And use, when you're using Intemp Connect, you can create custom configurations in the cloud and push them down to your device. And I'm going to show you how to do that in a minute. But right now we're just going to tap on start to begin the data logger logging our temperature data. And we can see now, we go back into Intemp Connect on our browser, on our computer. You can see down at the bottom of the screen where you can see I was logged in. You see the type of logger, the serial number, and when it was configured. So this gets pushed up to the cloud by your smartphone or your tablet.